Lung diseases occur as the weather changes from spring to summer. Nighttime moisture, water in your lawn at night, nighttime rainfall, too much watering, meaning watering every day. Give your lawn a chance to dry out in between watering. That will help you not to get lawn disease. When we come upon a lawn that has a disease, whether it's dollar spot, summer patch, glossarium blight, we immediately will put a fungicide down and it will take several applications of the fungicide. Now the fungicide will not make the disease just go away, it just stops it from spreading and eventually the lawn will come back. The signs of lawn diseases are blotchiness in the lawn. They could start out as small spots and within days erupt into larger, browner areas. Today we looked at a client's lawn and they had dollar spot. Dollar spot starts out as small spots about the size of silver dollars. And if untreated, they will grow into larger areas about the size of baseballs and completely cover the lawn until it's treated. It can spread several different ways. It can spread through wind, rain, mower clippings, the lawnmowers themselves going over the lawn, spreading it all over the lawn. So we like to put down a fungicide right away uh, before it gets cut again so it doesn't get spread to other areas of the property. There are different ways you can prevent lawn disease. One, like I had just mentioned, by pre-treating with a fungicide. And others are doing what's called a soil correction with our organic lawn care. We always do soil testing. We test the soil and see what it needs. It could need lime, humic acid, more organic matter. And by conditioning the soil in the lawn and having that perfect soil, that will help prevent lawn disease also. So we encourage our organic accounts to always do soil testing and get those soil corrections done to prevent lawn disease and other activities that you get in the lawn as far as insects and weeds.